Backpacking is an outdoor recreation where gear is carried in a backpack. This can include food, water, bedding, shelter, clothing, stove, and cooking kit. Often, backpacking trips last multiple days and are done in remote locations. These are the top 8 things to remember to bring for backpacking at Yosemite. 8. Water. You will need to stay hydrated. Water is one of the most important things to bring with you when backpacking, especially in hot weather. It is important to stay hydrated by drinking plenty of water and eating foods that contain water. Water is essential for the body to function properly. It helps to regulate body temperature, lubricate joints, and remove waste. The body is made up of approximately 60% water, so it is important to replenish the water that is lost through sweating, urination, and respiration. There are a few ways to make sure you are drinking enough water when backpacking. First, pack more water than you think you will need. It is better to have too much water than not enough. Second, drink water regularly throughout the day, even if you are not thirsty. Third, eat foods that contain water, such as fruits and vegetables. If you are backpacking in hot weather, it is even more important to stay hydrated. Drink extra water and take breaks in shady areas to cool down. Wear light color, loose-fitting clothing to help keep your body temperature down. It is also a good idea to pack a water filter or purifier in case you run out of water or run into water that is not safe to drink. Water filters and purifiers remove bacteria and other contaminants from water, making it safe to drink. By following these tips, you can make sure you stay hydrated while backpacking and enjoy your time in the great outdoors. 7. Insect Repellent There are many mosquitoes in Yosemite. If you're backpacking in Yosemite, you're bound to encounter mosquitoes. Be sure to pack insect repellent to keep them at bay. There are many different types of insect repellent on the market, so it's important to choose one that will be effective against mosquitoes. Look for a repellent that contains deep, the keratin, oil of lemon eucalyptus, or IR3535. Apply the repellent to exposed skin, and follow the instructions on the label. Insect repellent can help make your backpacking trip more enjoyable by keeping mosquitoes at bay. Be sure to pack it in your backpack before heading out into the wilderness. 6. Sunglasses, to protect your eyes from the sun. Sunglasses are one of the most essential items to bring when backpacking, especially if you plan on being in the sun for extended periods of time. Not only do they protect your eyes from the harmful UV rays, but they also help reduce glare knife fatigue. When choosing a pair of sunglasses, make sure to pick ones that fit well and offer adequate coverage. And if you can, invest in a pair with polarized lenses for even better protection. 5. A hat, to protect your head from the sun. A hat is an important item to bring when backpacking, especially if you are hiking in sunny weather. A hat will protect your head from the sun and help keep you cool. It is also important to choose a hat that is comfortable to wear and won't blow off in the wind. 4. A sunscreen, the sun can be very strong at high altitudes. A sunscreen is an important part of any backpacking trip. The sun can be very strong at high altitudes and can quickly lead to sunburn. A good sunscreen will help protect your skin from the sun's harmful rays. There are a few things to keep in mind when choosing a sunscreen for backpacking. First, you want a sunscreen that has a high SPF rating. The higher the SPF, the better the protection. Second, you want a sunscreen that is waterproof. This is important because you will be sweating and your sunscreen will need to be able to withstand the elements. Third, you want a sunscreen that is easy to apply. You don't want to have to stop and reapply your sunscreen every few minutes. There are a lot of great sunscreens on the market. However, my personal favorite is the Copper Tone Sport Sunscreen. It has a high SPF of 50 and is waterproof. It goes on easily and doesn't need to be reapplied often. 3. A camera, there are many scenic views. Through the mountains. There's something special about mountain views. They're so vast and expansive, and they make you feel small in the best way. Every time I see a mountain view, I can't help but be in awe of the natural beauty. One of the best things about backpacking through the mountains is that there are so many scenic views. Every turn in the trail seems to reveal a new and stunning vista. It's impossible to get bored of the scenery when there's always something new to see. For me, mountain views are a reminder of how vast and wild the world is. They make me feel alive and connected to something bigger than myself. Every time I see one, I can't help but feel a sense of wonder and appreciation for the natural world. 2. A map of the area, there are many trails to explore. A map of the area is an essential item for any backpacker. Not only will it help you plan your route and find your way around, but it can also be a handy reference if you get lost or encounter an unexpected obstacle. 
There are many different types of maps available, from simple paper maps to comprehensive GPS systems. No matter what level of detail you need, there's a map out there that will suit your needs. One of the most important things to consider when choosing a map is the scale. A map with a large scale, 1 colon 50 000, or larger, will show you more detail, but will be more difficult to carry around. A small scale map, 1 colon 250 000, or smaller, will be lighter and easier to carry, but won't show as much detail. Another important consideration is the level of topographic detail. A topographic map will show you features such as elevation contours, bodies of water, and trails. This can be extremely helpful in planning your route and avoiding obstacles. Finally, make sure the map you choose covers the area you'll be hiking in. There's no point in carrying a map of the whole state if you're only planning to hike a few miles in a small section of it. With so many different types of maps available, it's easy to find one that will meet your needs. Be sure to choose a map before heading out on your next backpacking adventure. 1. A good pair of hiking boots, you will be doing a lot of walking. There is no question that a good pair of hiking boots is one of the most important pieces of gear for a backpacking trip. Without a comfortable and supportive pair of boots, your entire trip could be ruined. Your feet are constantly in contact with the ground, and they are the foundation of your entire body, so it is important to make sure they are well taken care of. Hiking boots come in a variety of different styles and materials, so it is important to do your research before purchasing a pair. You need to find a boot that is comfortable and supportive, but also breathable and waterproof. There are a lot of different factors to consider, but if you take the time to find the right pair of boots, it will make a world of difference on your trip. We hope you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe for more content like this.